beginnings of a real uh, fruitful relationship with Barclay Elementary Middle School, Young Life Baltimore City, and St. Mo's. Adults and kids are getting connected. They're getting connected across ethnic uh, lines. Um, people are being uh, exposed to the good news of Jesus. My name is Josh Goodman, and I'm the Area Director for Young Life in Baltimore City. We have an amazing partnership with St. Moses Church. We've just loved how God has used this building to really impact this community already. We have a weekly mentoring breakfast here on Tuesday morning with students at the Barclay School, which is just two blocks from the church. One of the major challenges that our students face is just a lot of trauma in students from abandonment to moving six times before you're five years old to you know, drug abuse, being a part of a single parent home. In some of these studies on trauma, one of the things that they have found that really reverses this cycle of trauma is one caring, loving friend where the friendship is not based on performance. I remember meeting my first guy, his name was Makai, on the second day of school, and we talked for a little bit, and right away he said, Mr. Josh, would you come to my game tomorrow? It just revealed to me that every single one of our students longs to be loved, longs to be known, longs to be invited. And we know that there's just no substitute for a faithful, loving friend. We've heard from numerous parents that kids look forward to Tuesdays with their mentor. When we purchased this building and began a capital campaign to renovate it, um, we called that campaign Plan to Stay. We want to be rooted uh, in this community. We want to be part of this community. We want to pray for um, God's best for, for all of Baltimore, but doing what we can um, to bring the life of God and the goodness of God and to share uh, resources as we can in this cluster of neighborhoods right here in the heart of Baltimore City. Ian and I have about a combined 40 years of uh, attending BCC. I was on staff there in youth ministry for six years and so we just uh, have a lot of love for BCC and uh, a lot of our formative years were spent there at BCC. When you uh, share words of encouragement with us, when you're praying with and for us, coming up and visiting us through your financial support, uh, through coming up and helping out on our, our volunteer work days, we feel it and we're really grateful for you. Thank you.